hey YouTube, it's me, Rose Idols here. Okay, so this is um, a clothing collection video, the one that I promised you guys previously. So um, for that viewer that was interested in seeing um, who wears what, this video is for you and others that are interested. So um, yeah, so um, here's the clothes behind me currently. And I have two racks. And then there's shoes underneath. Let me see. I want to get to I want to get to the one behind first because I have it separated. Uh, I have it separated by like coats and then um, jackets and jeans and stuff. And then this one back here is like tops and sweaters and stuff like that and like tank tops. So yeah, uh, should I do shoes first? And I also have this whole other drawer here that I have to show you guys. Maybe I should do shoes first. Hold on, I'm moving you guys back a little bit. Uh, I'm gonna drop anything. Oh wait, gotta move my lighting. Okay. So, we're gonna start off with shoes, I guess. Okay. So, I have this little uh, bag. I don't even remember where I got this, to be honest. I think I bought like, I think I bought something on Etsy or something and I got this bag and decided to keep it. But it's like a little mesh bag and I kind of think of it as like a, um, you know like that bag that you use when you're washing your um, your underwear and bras and stuff that you separate from everything else. So I kind of think of it like that. So this is like what I keep the socks. So these are for the boys um, and the girls have their own. So <laughs> the girls just have a basic Ziploc bag. But yeah, so those are socks. And then I have these shoes here. And I have those shoes all right there. So I'll just go through these. These are mostly girl shoes. Yeah, I think these are all girl shoes. So I have some Uggs right here. And most of these are like little Converse, some school girl shoes. This was um, given to me by my friend. Um, I think these are R Rabbit. Yeah, so they're like R Rabbit. Well, it's too bright, but it says R Rabbit on the inside. And it has like this little wedge thing unfortunately this doesn't fit anybody like I don't have anybody in my crew that it fits right now so I've just been holding that off and I have these shoes I don't know if you can see that but they're like I think people call them Mary Jane or something so they're like white and um white and black little shoes I have these I had these in white but I sold the white ones um, and I think I had them in like all black also but I sold that so I only kept this one and then the schoolgirl shoes. I think these are MSD sized, but they fit like they, they're like six thirty or six point five centimeters, so they fit girls too if you have like if they have really small feet. So yeah, um, I think I got these on AliExpress. Um, so yeah, I got them in black and brown, and then this right here I got on Etsy. Um, these were actually uh, a pretty penny, but they were worth it. So um, these are actually for girls. The store said that it was sold out, but I I never believed that. So I messaged them like, hey, like, are you sure? Like, you sure you don't have one more? And they're like, oh yeah, we could make one for you if you just put in an order. And that's what I did, and I got these. I actually never used them um, yet because at the time that um, I was going to, I sold that body that could fit that size, and then I got the April Story body, and then I sold that body. Now she has no body. So these shoes are just sitting here. And then I have this, like a jean color. Hold on, the lighting is so bright. I kind of, I kind of tried uh, messing with it, trying to change positions. I don't know if you can see it now, yeah. Yeah, it's like a jean color. And then obviously white, they're like a little converse. All right, I know I'm gonna get irritated by this lighting, but yeah, and then black. And then, hold on. I have this like all organized, so it kind of irks me that it's like not organized right now. All right, and then red, and then pink. Uh, I don't know if you can see that. This is actually not the pink that I wanted. I wanted like a super light, um, <clears throat> super, super light pink, but the seller made a mistake and gave me this freaking fuchsia pink or whatever. So I'm actually really upset. They gave me a refund or whatever, but like, Ever since that happened, I was afraid to buy any more shoes from them because I was afraid they were gonna give me another wrong color. So, hold on, let me just move the lighting really quick. Cause I feel like it's too bright. 
All right, hopefully that helps a little bit. Probably won't, but whatever. All right, so I got these on Taobao. Um, they don't really belong to anyone. Like shoes, to be honest, aside from like, I think three shoes, four shoes that belong to Tay, everything else anyone could wear. Um, so this is like a red um, band. What are they called? I forgot. Um, I forgot the names for these, like the, the real life term. But yeah, they're like a red. Uh, damn, it's gonna bother me until I remember the name. Yeah, and then these shoes here, they're like um, they're like a checkered. I love checkered. So yeah, got those. Oh my goodness, my lighting is so bright. Yeah, and then I got these. Oh, by the way, yeah, I did say I got those on Taobao. I got these on eBay. So they're like. Notice how it's like a trend, how I have a lot of like Converse looking shoes. But yeah, so there's like the same red one, but instead of um, just plain red, it has like studs. Oh, and the red is suede. This is a suede material. This is actually a really good price. I don't remember. But like, I like this because it's like, it's very slim. Like it's, it's not bulky. When You know how sometimes you get those cheap shoes and then you, you put them on your dolls and they look super bulky and like, look like clown feet? Those are actually the opposite. So. These are girl shoes. See, okay, white is definitely not gonna appear good on here. Let me see if I can turn it off. Wait, let me open this light. All right, I don't know if you can see that, but they're like, they're like kids, like white vans, like gra grandma shoes, I don't know. I got these for five bucks because um, apparently they were in a bad condition, but I mean, they don't look like a bad condition to me. And then same thing with this one, five bucks. I did a video when I did my box opening. These are Tay shoes, by the way. They're like New Balances. Um, they're like my favorite shoe ever. Um, I just love how the sole is so realistic. It says A style or M style. I don't know. I'm pretty sure this is from one of those um, really expensive um, like VJD clothing stores. But uh, the per I don't know, the person just sold it for five bucks because it literally had this little scuff here. And they're like, oh yeah, these are really old and it's, it's kind of peeling in here, so um, five dollars. And I was like, girl, snatch, because I love New Balance. I would never buy New Balance for myself because it's so expensive, but five dollars shoes for BJD, like, come on. So that's it for sneakers. Well, aside from the ones that are on my dolls right now, I'll probably show you that towards the end, but yeah. And then these shoes I got on uh, eBay. I think, I think these were like, five five to eight bucks i don't remember like between that price range i don't remember but these are plastic i do not know why but i was thinking of taking some um some loctite like you know the rubber the rubber super glue and then brushing a little bit on the the sole just so it can have some so it doesn't it's not like plastic like this because when the glue dries it's like some it, it gives it a rubber feeling so it would like let's say I pose my doll, their their foot wouldn't slide because the, the shoes are plastic. It would be stopped by the rubber from the Loctite. So that's what I was thinking with that. And then these are Tay shoes. So yeah, they're like um, I think I have yeah they're like literally the same boots that hold on. So the same boots that he has on, you can't see because it's really dark back there, uh, right there. So he has these on, but the difference is um, his is just plain black and then it doesn't have this uh, snake skin texture. So um, yeah, this is snake skin and then I added a skull. So I put a skull on there. Um, yeah. Uh, I think I got those, yeah, I got those from eBay. And the one that he has on, I got them from Taobao. I got this from Taobao. These are like laser. Nobody's ever wore these. <laughs> these are for Tay, and um, I think these are bigger than than his feet. Yeah, because Tay is like I think a size seven and a half um, in centimeters. So these are way too big. Well, they're not way too big. I would have to put some like some uh, cotton balls in there. But it's, I just I feel like I just haven't gotten the right outfit for him yet for him to put them on. So yeah, yeah. I got these from Taobao, and then. Got these, the last two from Taobao. These were um, for um, Wuben, my um, Makona doll, Young, but I have since sold him uh, because I was downsizing. Sorry, I'm like distracted by the chain. I hate chains like these because they always get all tangled up. 
and then it's just I just hate when they're tangled like I just I can't help but want to fix it but yeah so these are for Ruben but um I no longer have him so these are for anyone if any if this goes to anybody's um style in my collection it's for them but yeah it's just a basic boot it's really high and then last but not least these are like my favorite boots these are so expensive <laughs> but I love them so these are for Tay they're like I don't know they they're like they're like rodeo boots I don't know so the uh, Tay actually has this um I drew a tattoo on his chest um with this and then he also has like a keychain and just other things that have this so this is like his um I don't know it's like his signature symbols mark I don't know but anyways yeah so this moves around like that and then the laces are made out of chains and then there's like a decoration zipper here um the actual zipper is in the back and then the boot is made out of suede and then you have this uh detailing here some metal and then the sole has like some engraved like these look like you know those fairyland boots like um there was actually some that i wanted i don't remember what doll it was for it was a fipo 65 um not ro was it royal i don't remember but like you know how like the men they have like really nice steampunk looking like shoes and stuff so um when i saw these i was just like oh my gosh like this is like something like that and usually when you see the the fairyland um clothing on the secondhand market like it's way 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 too much money so um this was a cheaper alternative and i bought them um i think these were like i want to say 30 I'll have to look because I got these like literally last year um, but Tay has never worn these because once again he hasn't had the right outfit for them um, but yeah if you want to see yeah these are like my favorite shoes this and the new balances um, and I love the laser one but he hasn't worn those two yet so yeah all right so I think that's it for shoes for shoes yeah um, and then let me go through this drawer really quick so this is all girl clothes. Um, what's on the hangers, like both the racks right now, are boy clothes. So I keep all the girl clothes in here because I don't notice how I don't have any girl bodies at the moment. So I feel like it's a waste to take up that space for girl clothes if they're not even here. So socks, I'm not gonna really stick to them. I think there's some bras in here, I think. Yeah, so what is this? All right, this is a pair of underwear and then a bra so i got i got the underwear from my bayer from on um, ebay and then i got the bra um i like the bra on Taobao. and then i think i got these socks from ebay as well from the same person my bayer oh my gosh i don't know if you will be able to see it but it's like it's it's like a what is this called um it's like a lace and it has hearts like the lighting is too bright but it's like a lace and it has hearts. Um, and then these are actually like tights, like black tights. Um, I love these. I want to actually get some for my boys um, and then like cut cut off this soft part and then have it kind of like, cause Tay wears shorts, so kind of like um, tights underneath and then shorts above that. If you if you know Big Bang, um, what's his name? Taying, like the way his style is, like like that. And then, obviously, some white high top socks, like knee high. And then, I think I have them in black too. Yeah, and then black. Yeah, so that's basically it. I had some other um, socks, like this bag was full, but um, the bodies that I'm more into are slimmer, and they were they were socks more for like thicker thighs or thicker, thicker calves and stuff, but I since got rid of those bodies so I decided to put them up for sale all right so this shirt is a custom order well it didn't look like this it was literally just the long sleeve and then the transfer uh, it's looking like I'm gonna have to change my lighting for this maybe if it's too dark then I'll use the brighter lighting but I'll just keep the darker one for now um, but yeah so this was a custom this is um, Jackson from got seven um, and basically it was just a shirt but uh, I did this whole dye thing and then I cut up the cut up the bottom part and I was gonna cut up the the arms but I don't know I felt like that was a little too much and then on the back it has like 
these button claps so you don't have to take the shirt off just to put it on yeah and then I'm honestly I feel like I have to like breeze through this because there I have a lot of clothes you guys it's either gonna I'm either gonna breeze through this or if if I find myself not going as fast as I want to I'll break it up into two parts because yeah okay yeah so next dress got this on um oh by the way that commission that i did for, for that was um from somebody on um etsy this i got on i want to see either ebay or aliexpress i do not remember but i love this it's like a cute little cat um and then oh there's some guy clothes in here so these two they don't really belong to anyone they're just like they're just like things that i wanted to sell but then i couldn't i couldn't i couldn't what's the word I couldn't I couldn't find the courage I don't know I, I just didn't feel like selling them because I really like them so these are I think bears these are made by bears yeah these are made by bears so they're like they're kind of a turtleneck but not completely and they're they're more suited for his body because like they're more for a really big doll so yeah those two and then these came with um, Zane's body um, I haven't given it to anyone. I do not want these for Zane. Zane will not wear this ever again. But yeah. Um, oh, these right here are for Tay. Uh, Tay, the really, really tall one right there. Um, so these are his shorts. Uh, I added this button. It was just for plain black shorts, but I just added that so it can have some kind of, um, I don't know, some kind of spark to it. But um, these were, I, I commissioned uh, Cotton Honey to make these. So yeah. Um, I made these myself. These are for Tay. These were his original shorts. Um, and then I added some spandex. But, and then he has a Velcro. <laughs> these are so shitty. <laughs> but they work. Like, I used them for like three months. And I made these. Um, I got the fabric, I think, from, from either Walmart or, um, Michaels. But yeah, those are for Tay also. Okay, so these were all for Sunny. But, um... She doesn't have a body right now, so um, I'll, I also have other girls on the way, so like it'll split between them. But for now, th th I'm just gonna call these girl clothes. They're not like really for anyone. All right, so Sunny, girl clothes. This right here. Um, yeah, I got this on eBay. Got got this on eBay. Like to go. Uh, let me see. I have a lot of shirts in here. These were all commissioned by the same person, except for one of them, I think, or two. Two of them were given to me by Kwaku Creations um, because I did a, uh, I did a order for her or with her, so she gave me some stuff. All right, so we have this. This is Hing Won from Months X. I made this meme. I just found this picture online and I added this. It says, "Unlike um, who are you again?" <laughs> so yeah, that's a shirt that I got commissioned. Um, this is uh, Taehyung, and then this was something on my phone that I found, and I really like this, so I was like, make that into shirt. Oh, by the way, the reason why these are kind of in here is because I haven't customized them yet, so this is too plain to be put on a doll, so I need to figure out what I'm going to do. Either I'm going to, um, I don't know, paint, I don't know, I'm going to do something, because I just, it can't, like, they can't wear it like this. It's too boring. Uh, this shirt, this is um, Park Sora. She's a model for Style Nanda, the Korean makeup brand line. Yeah, so. And then this is Hayes. Hayes, I don't know if I'm saying it right. She's a singer, um, an artist, a Korean singer. And then there's some more. Hold on. Okay, so let me see. There's quite a lot in here. So actually, I commissioned this person to make, I think it was 35, it was either 30 or 35 shirts. So here's some more. This chick right here. Oh, sorry, nudity. And then Robert Downey Jr. I freaking love him. Did I say Robert? Did I say him? Robert Downey? Yeah, I did. I don't know. I feel like I said, <laughs> for some reason in my mind, I thought I said Johnny Depp. Um, and then here's Johnny Depp. And then here's Jackson again. These are basically all the same looking shirt, just different pictures. And then um, this is Sushomaru, yeah, from Inuyasha, Inuyasha's older brother, yeah. So once again, need to customize these because they're too plain. I might send them to Kwaku Creations in like 
see what she can do. Okay, so we have, how many more? All right, so we have these. So same person, but these are long sleeve now. So I had, I had some other long sleeve colors, but I got rid of them. So this is the same girl, Highs, the Korean singer. I love her. This is Nick Kun from 2PM. He's also a Korean artist. This is like, I don't remember the name of the mountains, but this is like somewhere in Japan. And I really loved it, like the scene, scenery. So I was like, I wanted a shirt. This is one of my favorite animes, um, Shinshan or Cart. Is Shinshan an anime? I mean, it is technically, technically is anime. I mean, whatever. But yeah, that's his little junk. I remember this episode. <laughs> uh, put a comment down below if you like Shinshan because I like this so much that I felt like my BJDs had to wear him. <laughs> oh, um, here was the two shirts that uh, Kawaku Creations gave me free um, for ordering a lot, I guess. Um, so it says send nudes, like noodles, that's cute. And then this is a shirt with Iki. Um, this is like a, this is like his, uh, I forgot what you called it, to like promote his, um, promote his thing he's a DJ so yeah I just love it she had like different versions but I chose this one yeah and then what else we have in here oh here's some more skirts see this is only in the box so I haven't even gotten to that that's what I meant by like I don't know if I'm gonna like do one video or two okay so you guys should have seen these already because I did box openings for like most of these but whatever so pleated skirt in black this is the same as the other one the burgundy one i don't know why it wasn't together but i usually have them in like like color coded all right that's better i'm so anal all right so i have black and then burgundy they're literally the same thing that's why i'm going so fast the gray color and then uh the beige the what is this called um khaki color and then this is like a striped one with like a kitty and then I added this um, <clears throat> this pin on there. I don't know, it was just laying around and I was like, might as well just put it on this. And then I customized this one. It was just literally the, um, the jean part, but I was just like boring. So I put these on there. I should put something on the back. Maybe I should put like some, some cute little rhinestones or something, but yeah. Um, these irritate the hell out of me because like, they like they tend to fall out so I take a, a tool and I bent this to make it stay on more so yeah and then these skirts so I, I had more but I since sold them I had like a pink color I had a brown color and I had a green one but I sold them so yeah so this one is like a blue green you can't really see because the lighting but yeah and then this red I had two red ones sold the other one and then this one is my favorite one. It's like a, a black with like, it's like a black with white and red. Okay, um, damn, there's still more in here. Uh, for whatever reason, these jeans are in here. Once again, these are not for, like the jeans and stuff are not really for anyone. Like anyone can wear the jeans. More, it's, it's most of these that are like for certain people, but like jeans and like, jeans and like shoes and stuff like that are not really for people. It's just like anyone can wear them. These I do not remember. I think these are either these are either um, bears or they're either um, what's the other person? These are I got them from Taobao by the way. What? Oh my gosh! I can never remember their 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 store. Oh, I can't remember. This was given to me by my friend. Well, no, actually I bought these, um, and then she gave me like shoes and other stuff. But yeah, these were from Wizard Lord, Lord Shay. She gave these to me, or I bought them from her and they're girl shorts what is this oh this is a uh, the ttya um cardigan remember how i, I did the B bjd sale post or not post video and i had the green and green and gray color i think so i decided to keep the black one so yeah this is more for him to be honest yeah and then these are also for him i have a white t-shirt in a gray t-shirt and then this 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 I don't know this is not if this were to belong to anyone it would belong to Hashish to be honest like he's more into this type of thing like I don't know 
and then I put a vampire and a, a match pin on there and then on the back oh, I dropped it on the back it had um, it said Guns N' Roses, it had like a, a patch on there, but I don't know, I took it off for some reason and now I regret it. <laughs> so I'm either going to buy another one, another patch and put it back on there, or I'm just going to paint something, like paint some words and then probably add a transfer image on the back, I don't know. That's why they're in here. So if you see like some mail pieces in here, it's because like there's something I want to do to it. It's either something I want to do to it or it doesn't belong on the rack for whatever reason. This is... Um, this is the, the shirt that came with Jack the Ripper for the full set. So, um, yeah, that's, I don't know why that's in here. It should be in the box. <laughs> uh, these are some leather pants. Last scene on Kane, but he's in the box being trying to be sold right now. So, yeah, I need to put these on the rack, to be honest. Um, oh, I remember these. All right, so this dress, never been used. This is um, something I got off of Etsy. I think this is so cute. I don't remember how much this was. It wasn't that expensive, to be honest. But yeah, never been used because by the time I got it, like, her body was gone, so. And then these, I think all three of, wait. Okay, yeah, all three of these were by the same person and this was another person. So if you remember the black skirt that I was selling, this was made by that person, the one that sent me the black skirt. And then this one was made by the person that made the the suede cardigan and the suede shorts. This was by that person. I do not remember their name because their name was like long and weird. Yeah, so I'm just going to show you one. They're like literally all the same thing. Let me show you the lighter one actually. Probably easier to see. Yeah, so it's like it's like a cute little bralette. And then the, the back you actually have to put the ribbons through to keep it on. But yeah, that's it for that. Um, I'm just gonna leave this stuff laid out because putting this stuff away is gonna waste time. Okay. What else do I have in here? Alright, uh, alright, moving on to this. I'm not doing the accessories because I feel like that's a little much because they have a lot of accessories. So. I'm moving their plants out of the way. There's like little decoration plants and stuff. So I was moving those out of the way. Um, okay. So, let me see what time I'm at. Uh, 27. Should I cut it here? I feel like I should. Um, I'm probably gonna cut it here and then make it a part two. So, um, yeah, that's it for what was in the drawer. I cannot believe the drawer took that long. Yeah, so that was like mostly like, um, like I said, girl clothes and stuff that um, needs to be customized and um, either I just don't feel like putting it on the rack because I don't think it looks as nice as everything else. But yeah, that's it for that. Um, stay tuned for the second part. Um, I'm probably going to post them at the same time. So I'm just going to stop recording and then continue recording like literally in like a minute. But um if you're interested in seeing that yeah just just wait for the next part um you know like subscribe all that and leave a comment on what you think so far bye